What's up guys, it's me your badass host Draven and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Unova Red walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode we went to the Seafone Islands, you know, on a quick visit and we got ourselves a new Pokemon which, well, you guys already know, his name is Kyurem. Look at this Pokemon right here. The Ice and Dragon type Pokemon of Unova, you know, another Pokemon that slipped my mind. And in this episode, we are going to be going straight to the Cerulean Cave, mainly because, well, nobody's guarding it. We have the Surf Technique. Probably should take a chance and see what's there. Now, I did equip myself with the Master Ball, so we are going to find out what... We're going to find out quickly who is in there, what is in there, and all that stuff, now that it's open. Now, we did bring Kyurem just for this occasion. Uh, because more than likely we're going to be seeing some Pokemon of like at level 50, 60, or uh, and above. And I don't know. Chances are we're going <laughs> to... Yeah, chances are we're going to, uh, you know, get some Pokemon that are well above level. So here it is going into the Cerulean Cave right here, guys. And, well, let's see. We're going to keep these two Pokemon right here just in case. And, well... Along the way, we're going to try and get ourselves some items right here. That way, you know, we we can actually do something, uh, you know, against Sabrina. Now, let's see what kind of Pokemon we find here. And here we have a Wild Woobat at level 32, so... <laughs> okay, so this this is kind of weird. So the, the levels got scaled down. Hmm. Huh. Would you look at that? Huh. So... Huh. This right here is, uh... Yeah, this right here is a little surprising. And, well, look at that. You'll find yourself a Ponyard right here. <laughs> Never mind. Huh, so, in my mind, I was thinking that you're gonna, you're gonna be finding the same, you know... Pokemon at the same level and whatnot. Huh. Okay, so let's get the heck out of here. Uh, I think my next question is, what kind of Pokemon you will find at the end of Cerulean Cave? I want to know about this, so let's go ahead and see what, what, what it's all about. Let's see. And, well, let's go ahead and put on a... Put on a Repel just for this occasion. And, well, let's see. Let's see what we got. Okay, so let's go straight to Mudslide or Mud... Well, whatever it is. And... Well, let's see what we got right here. And let's see. Huh. I am very, very curious. Again, this game makes me all curious and all that stuff. I'm like, really, like, how in the hell do you change most of these things up and... Huh. Unless I'm forgetting something, because, like, okay, Victini is usually the... Well, Victini is the very first Pokemon in the Unova decks. Uh, I'm only assuming that you'll find... Uh, huh. I'm thinking it's Landris. I'm only assuming it's Landris right here. So, let's go right ahead and use a Mudslide right here. Because if it is Muds... If it is Landris, then I, there, I don't think I'm going to need a... Yeah, I don't think I'm going to need the Master Ball for anything. Unless, uh, I don't know. Shoot. So here we go. Full Restore. And, well, let's go right ahead and see what, we are, what we're all about right here. Actually, we're going to go right here. And let's go ahead and actually not do that. Now, if the levels here are scaled down, then it, yeah, more than likely it's going to be Landris. And... I can only assume that it's uh oh crud that we're probably gonna be needing a uh, probably gonna be needing something. I don't know. Alright, let's go ahead and see what, what we can do. Okay. Right here. Let's go right here and grab an item. And look at that. We found ourselves an ultra ball. What can we find here? I don't even know. <laughs> And it, it's so funny how, like, you know, right now I'm actually, I'm just doing this. And it's all because of the Surf technique, guys. Surf actually opened up the whole world to us. And, well, I'm actually very excited to see what we can actually find right here. So, let's go right up ahead right here. 
And, well, let's go down here. And, well, let's see. We are very, very close to... Yeah, we are very, very close to the next Pokemon that we're going to be getting. And this one, we found ourselves a Max Revive. Obviously, we use the Max Revive to uh, revive... <laughs> To revive, uh, revive Giga Lift and all that stuff. So let's go right back. And well, let's see. Let's go right ahead and find out what Pokemon we can get. And there we go. Found ourselves another Ultra Ball. So it's just telling. All of that is just telling that it might be another legendary Pokemon, Landris. All right. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Come on. Please let it be something cool. <laughs> something awesome. I don't know. Or some legendary Pokemon that I have yet to find out about or something like that. I don't know. And, well, eh, there is the legendary Pokemon. wonder what level it could be. Alright, so I have the Master Ball with me, okay? Have the Master Ball with me just in case you can't capture this guy where it's at level 70. So I'm going to save the game, and I'm going to switch up the Pokemon right here. I'm actually going to switch it up. I'm going to go with, I'm going to go with, uh, let's see, Gigalith right here, just because it could put it to sleep, and Mew. Huh. Alrighty, guys, so here is the next legendary Pokemon, and it is Reshiram. Wow. Holy crud. Never thought that it would be Reshiram. My, my, my money was on literally dead ass on, uh, on Landris. But it looks like to me that Landris might be in the Victory Road. Victory Cave or Victory Road. I don't even know what... I'm like right now my mind is like elsewhere. But god dang. Holy crud. Never thought it would be that way. And god dang it. It was a freaking critical hit. So let's go with Zekrom right here. And let's go ahead and go with Thunderbolts. Gotta paralyze this guy. And, well, I can't really do much except for just like, just looking. So let's go with an Ultra Ball right here. And as you can see, we're just gonna purposely uh, get this Pokemon fainted and try and get it to, uh, what was it, Gigalith. The key to all these capturings right here. And wow. Wow. Okay, Mudslide. Mudshot. Its speed has fallen. Okay, so it's on the red. Literal red. Let's go ahead and use one of these uh, Max Revives. And, well, because of that that one shot, it actually enables us to, uh, to put this guy to sleep right here. And, well, let's go with an Ultra Ball. Come on, baby. Come on. Okay, so that's one. Of course, I'm going to be pressing the speed button whenever this thing happens. And... Come on, come on. God dang it. God dang it. Alright, we're going to have to go with uh, Oinkinator right here. Let's go ahead and revive our Pokemon. Yeah, these legendary Pokemon are no joke when it comes to trying to capture these guys. So let's go ahead and use a Hyper Potion on this guy. Let's go ahead and use a, another Revive onto Zekrom just in case. And full restore onto this guy. Okay, so he can he can hurt my Pokemon. It's just that I've already slowed it down to a point where I can use this. Come on. Okay, so it's asleep finally. And well, let's go ahead and go for an Ultra Ball right here. I could use the Master Ball. It's tempting. It is very tempting. But let's go with the Ultra Ball. Come on, baby. Come on. Ah, crap. And it's still asleep. Okay, so come on. We still got another chance. Come on, Reshiram. Oh, damn it. And it's still asleep. Okay. Come on, baby. Come on. Stay in that ball. God dang it. And it's still asleep. Okay, so we have a chance. A legitimate chance to actually get this guy. It's just this next ball better hit it. Come on, baby. God dang it. Still awake. Okay, he woke up. Come on. Yes. Okay, so it's asleep. And okay. Alrighty. So let's go with an Ultra Ball. Come on, baby. Get in that ball. God dang it. Okay, here we go. Come on. Let's get it. God dang it. Okay, please don't wake up. 
Be cool, man. Come on. You want to be with your brother and sister, or... I don't know. There we go. There we go. And... Throwing out the peace sign, guys. Throwing out the goddamn peace sign. Oh, my God. Whew. Okay. So, we caught all three legendary Pokemon. So, as you can see, guys, Reshram, the vast white Pokemon. This Pokemon is from the Legends. It sends flames into the air from its tail, burning up everything. Okay, and no, I am not going to nickname this guy. Holy crud. Wow, that right there was, uh... <laughs> that right there was something. So we got the three legendary Pokemon of of Unova. Didn't even think about them. I'm being honest, guys. Didn't even think about them. I actually thought that we were done with legendaries, but no. And that's it. We caught all three of them, and it looks like to me that we're, yeah. I think I have a whole new team planned out right here because they are all at level 50s. I get it, guys. I know all three legendary Pokemon, whatever. But this is a hack game, and you know what? I might as well do it. I might as well do it, but there, I, I kind of feel like there's more secrets. Like, there's still something there that, like, we're kind of missing. And, well, let's see. What kind of Pokemon uh, should I send back to? Kill a Croc? Nope. Uh, it looks like, to me, it might be Mudslide because, uh... <laughs> yeah, okay. So, here we have Reshiram. And, well, let's go ahead and take a look at this new Pokemon right here. It's asleep with 3 HP left. Here it is, the Fire and Dragon type Pokemon, Reshiram. Pretty balanced, and look at the moves it has. It, yeah, this, this right here is a pretty stacked team. There is just one little thing, and that is that, well, they're pretty much legendary. Holy crud, I, I, I can't even, like, words can't even explain it right now, because, like, wow, I thought that we were done. I seriously thought we were done, but there it is. So, god dang, let's see. What can we do? <laughs> Pretty much nothing right here, guys. Like, okay, so now we have a good team. The weakest one is Gigalith, which will actually fly us from place to place now. I think... I think I'm going to switch a Pokemon here and there, maybe Gigalith, because we already have maybe a Pokemon here that can actually fly. Uh, with something else, we'll, we'll figure it out along the way, but as of right now, I think we've had a good successful, like, you know, you know, capturing a Pokemon and all that stuff. So what I'm going to do off screen is I'm going to try and capture the Pokemon that I haven't seen in these two uh, last two locations, that way we can actually trade for the for the legendary Pokemon that are yet to be traded. So I'll be back for another episode, guys. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, yeah, stay tuned. It's gonna get more. It's gonna get a lot more interesting when we get our next badge. So again, see you guys. Uh, well, thank you guys again. And I'll see you guys next time.